everyone, this is Janice with Cricketology.blogspot.com and just wanted to, I just came back from Joann's and I found these. Okay, I um, saw a video um, done by um, Crafting with Christina and she showed how to use these to re-sticky your cricket mat. <laughs> um, so here's what it looks like opened. There's three in a pack, and Joann's had 40% off their scrapbooking adhesives, so it was $1.20 off. So I thought, hey, might as well try it. Um, I re-stickied one side and didn't the other, so I could show you what I did. And I haven't tried this yet. Okay, I, I just added some paper, and that's how sticky it is. Okay, and I'll show you. This, this mat is so bad. It's it's ripping, it's dirty, it's it's bad. Okay, but look, there's nothing. No sticky. This side, two fingers. One finger. It's sticky. Okay. I'm really hoping this really works because she says it works for her. Christina does. And when she did the video, she, video, she said she applies it two times. Two applications. The packaging says two strokes and weight, um, what does it say, remove cap, apply, apply at least two strokes, let dry 90 seconds before bonding. So that's not very much wait time. Now what I've been using up till now is the brake clean to take the old adhesive off and the stick and spray from Crafter's Companion that I get at Custom Props. But, um, you know, and that lasts because I haven't bought a new can in a while. However, I do have several mats that I rotate. I mean, several, probably, I don't know, six or eight. I'm not even sure how many I have. Okay, so that's two applications, two strokes, and I can't see through this, so I don't know how much is left in there. And I'm just going to wait, and I'm going to run this through my Cricut right now and see how how well it does. So, I did it, and it's coming up a little bit on this side. It did not move, though. It didn't shift. You can see the paper didn't shift at all. Um, it's really stuck on there, but there's no residue on the back of the paper. I am cutting out pieces for my bear in the trash can challenge. Here's his little face. Got to move. I love it. Okay, well, I'm going to keep using this technique for now and see how it does. Now, report back if I, is there anything I find positive or negative. Um, I did the other side and okay, so it's sticky. So um, thanks for watching everyone. We'll see how this works out. Hopefully it works because it seems like it would be a pretty um, affordable way to re-sticky your mats. Thanks for watching.